Assalamualaikum uh, Today uh, we are from group 5 My name Muhammad Izaaz bin M. Johari And my metric 275525 Okay for today we want to present about the importance of service design In order to improve quality in hotel So before I start uh, I want to ask, uh, do you uh, ever seen or do you uh, see the Oyo Hotel before? Oyo Hotel is the uh, largest uh, hotel in the world. So Oyo Hotel is a hotel chain that have around the world, include Malaysia. So uh, currently, they have about 23,000 a uh, hotel in the world their motto is uh, provide users uh, with everything they need for comfortable stay so uh, for the serv service design methodology is to establish the most effective uh, practice for designing service according to both the needs and fulfill the customer satisfaction Traditional quality function deployment is a systematic uh, process that assists team in taking customer feedback, determining the underlying uh, underlying issue uh, represented by those comments and deploy deploying developing the developing quantifying. Uh, quantifiable uh, customer requirement using that knowledge Assalamualaikum uh, Today uh, we are from group 5 My name Muhammad Izaaz bin M. Johari and my metric 275525 Okay, for today we want to present about the importance of service design in order to improve quality in hotel so before I start uh, I want to ask uh, do you uh, ever seen or do you uh, see the Oyo Hotel before Oyo Hotel is the uh, largest uh, hotel in the world so Oyo Hotel is a hotel chain that have around the world include Malaysia so uh, currently they have about 23,000 uh, hotel in the world their motto is uh, provide users uh, with everything they need for comfortable stay so uh, for the serv service design methodology is to establish the most effective uh, practice for designing service according to both the needs and fulfill the customer satisfaction traditional quality function deployment is a systematic uh, process that assists team in taking customer feedback determining the underlying uh, underlying issue uh, represented by those comments and deploy deploying developing the developing quantifying uh, quantifiable uh, customer requirement using that knowledge for the next point uh, the second important uh, is that service design serve a series of cues in creating a service uh, centric experience for the customer to get an effective cre uh, to get an ex uh, effective uh, service design is the queue is needed to orchestrate at the different place and time to develop the continuation uh, that developing customer experience this will abandon abandoned in the customer uh, physiology about the experience that they have 
Later, the customer will create a whole uh, or holistic experience by combining the clue they pick up along the journey and abandon in their uh, physiology. So I pass to another presenter. My name is Hafiz Iqmal Hakim Biramli, metric number 271249. I will be presenting about how can service design be implemented successfully. To implement survey design successfully, a systematic management and design of client experience through the precise planning of physical and intangible service features in the service delivery system is deemed necessary. This prop impasses to the service functional features such as delivery rather than its technical features to bring more impact to the customer, especially in terms of psychology. Besides that, service managers play a major role in implementing service design successfully as this is their field of expertise. Service manager must also be service designer since continuous innovation is a competitive advantage for the business. Doing new business is one of the ways to implement the service design effectively. This is due to the old services being provided by the hotel industry that are already accustomed to the customer. Customer believe that hotel services to be mainly identical to and intangible with one another so the hotel needs something fresh to stay in the competition. Moving on to the next part, part the differentiation between hotel industry with another industry. Hotel industry is a branch of hospitality industry. Hospitality industry consists of three main branches and that is accommodation industries, food and drink industries, and also travel and tourism industry. The hotel industry is under the accommodation which is catering lodging and customer overnight stay such as hotel, motel, resort, BNB, and, and also hostel. Food and drink industry categorize business like restaurant, bar, cafe, catering, and club in them, while travel and tourism industry include travel agent, tour operator, cruise, and car rental. Although the scope varies significantly, hotel industry intimately ties to travel and hospitality sector. This term, hotel industry and hospitality industry has always been confused and misunderstood as the same thing. Although it is related and has some overlap with each other, the latter industry is far broader and comprises a wide range of industry while the former is only concerned with providing accommodation and related service to the visitor. In contrast, the hospitality industry is focused with luxury and broader sense of leisure. As a result, it offers hotel, restaurant, bar and cafes catering such nightlife such as club and variety service from travel and tourism industry. While travel industry is also centered on service where people travel and enjoy themselves. My name is Ching Wijie and my street number is 277145. I will continue with the impact of COVID-19 in service design on the hotel industry. The benefits in technology innovation hospitality is to improve service design in hotel industry. They are examples of technology used for digital transformation for service design in the hotel industry, which are robotic maps, smart sensors, and cloud technology. There are six other service design in hotel industry, which are operating procedure, guys feedback, service innovation, management and marketing, measure and monitor, and prevention. First, after service design for operating procedure, due to the pandemic COVID-19, a lot of companies and industry are being closed if a worker or customer are being affected. This will make company loss in match because will inform public and make customer decide not to make a service. So to avoid facing this problem, a strict procedure is practiced. There are many changes in standard operating procedure to maintain social distancing in the hotel industry. 
first, conduct a regular temperature scanning, offer free sanitizer and mask, and COVID-19 rapid test for every guy during check-in. And second, check. Uh, and second, employees must wear mask, face shield, and hand glove. The third is uh, have to ask guys to sign a declaration card attesting to their COVID-free status, and check every guys whether they are 14 days after vaccination or not. And the fourth one is increase vigilance. In, cl in cleaning the room. For example, ultraviolet light disinfectant. And the fifth is room service are allowed when go, when go to meals only. Second, other service design for guys feedback. The hotel industry promoting user hotel interaction because it allows for accurate feedback from clients. This allows guys to provide evaluations and experiences at the hotel. Guys in hotel industry can text or WhatsApp if they have any issues during their visit. Uh, the staff can request visitors to finish a feedback form. A presence via online media with a spot update and moreover cleanliness and hygiene are also need to pay attention. The hotel industry needs to increase precaution because good hygiene in hotel is important. The third one is update service design for service innovation. The hotel industry needs to utilize advanced technology. Hotel industry implementing technology innovations for decreasing guys' interaction, which enable customer with hotel staff by using self-service technology. This enables to improve perception of safety, reduce perceived health risk and customer anxiety, and enhance cleanliness. The first one is face recognition system, key card shipping, voice control. And second, short check-in machine, mobile registration system. And third one is self-cleaning space, particularly public washroom. And four is self-ordering technology in the artery. And the fifth one is using mobile apps or cards to transfer payment. Thank you. Hi, Assalamualaikum. My name is Shamira. So we'll proceed with the updated service design uh, in management and marketing for hotel industry. So service design require hotel management to make some changes in how they construct their service. So this holistic concept provide businesses a guest-centric model of marketing and process design. So it will lead on how this type of service can help to encourage uh, positive reputation, even uh, recommendation by the customer. So they will be better understand what makes a service design different from other types of marketing with technology adoptions and engagement strategies. Proceed with the updated service design in major and monitor for hotel industry. Okay, as I said before, guests are at the center of service design and have access to set standard of digital service on how management is doing in short terms and in long term. So the direct benefit are that businesses experience when they take a service design approach, uh, such as uh, having service design based on customer needs, service design with a goal uh, that clearly to be uh, achieved and customer is their primary focus and uh, having a service design to create a value for the user and focus uh, of the end uh, experience of the customer and the last one the importance of creating unified system for delivering in service design Okay, the last one is updated service design in uh, prevention for hotel industry. So conducting small scale experiment was really useful uh, to identify risk and prevent COVID-19 disease. So there are examples of prevention use of our service design in hotel industry. First, hotel guest communication has become a contactless, so less face-to-face -face and physical touch. Okay, next, removing all lo lobby furnitures uh, to follow the regulations. And the third one is uh, the government has ordered to closure the uh, swimming pools to avoid uh, COVID, uh, spread of COVID-19. And the last one is room-by-room -room contactless uh, food delivery instruction will introduce. So, for example, 
China uh, use robotic uh, to deliver food and supply uh, to the hotel room uh, to avoid the human touch. Okay. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and hi everyone. My name is Muhammad Zulaiman bin Muhammad Zamri and my metric number is 281050. Now, I would like to present the recommendation from this topic. First, is a hotel direct sales strategy. The goal of this strategy is to ensure that hotel can continue to accept all reservations such as direct booking. Direct booking has several advantages such as the hotel can make maximum profit because there is no need to pay commission for the using agent. To achieve this strategy, hotel managers should invest in build an official website hotel. The website also need to make it easier for potential customer to reserve a room is by click the booking button, as well as to make website friendly in terms of neatness. This is to ensure the customer have a positive experience and enjoy themselves while booking. Second is cross functional sales strategy. Actually, this strategy is a focus on main event because every year on the calendar, our country have a various event. Therefore, hotel management must take this advantage of this opportunity to make a profit by implementing a cross functional sales strategy. For example, the event based promotion of MotoGP Sepang. As a result, both domestic and international customers went to find a big hotel to make it easy for them to attend the event. Then, the hotel management also need to play a role by providing the best service and promotions that attract potential buyer to book hotel and room. With this strategy, it can increase sales and raise the name of the hotel. Other point of strategy for hotel industry development is segmentation and price optimization. It is very important to segment the customer to charge the right price to the right customer segment. This is because each customer has their different charm. One of the advantage of using this method, it can help customer and get the optional price according to the segmentation. For example, Hotel Sama Sama has a price between RM244 ringgit to RM1099 ringgit depending on the customer charge. From there, we can see that the hotel needs to use this method to get option to their potential customer to choose. Lastly, it's highlight about safety and hygiene. Due to COVID-19 hitting around the world, it had huge impact especially the hotel industry and it is also a new norm for the industry. Among them, it's a change in behavior from customer were more careful during this pandemic because few of being infected. Then, hotel management also needs to keep the risk as long as possible, such as sanitize regularly. They need to sanitize elevators, entrance and exit doors, and maintain the hygiene during this COVID-19. From this method, it can ensure customer safety and help the country deal in the pandemic COVID-19 with new normal. In conclusion, the report is prepared to understand the topic we choose which is why does service design is important in order to improve quality in the hotel industry. It shows that quality is a very much impious in this hotel industry. Every customer who book in a room at the hotel want the best service and good quality from that hotel. For example, Receiving a good service from the staff, comfortable and neat rooms, have a good facility and so on. It is because they have paid for the service and get the best quality. Thank you very much.